Okay, hey everybody, this is Grace. I just got out of the store and uh, I felt kind of weird about something. Uh, now, I'm Texan and I live in Texas. And many Texas Texans I know, we're kind of used to our wide open spaces. And, you know, we have our, our maybe our comfort zone is a bit wider than many because, you know, we're used to not being cramped. Yeah. Okay. But anyway, um, I just went to a store I haven't been to in a long time, and I'm afraid I'm going to wind up getting turned around. Yeah, I might get lost out here. <laughs> I don't go here. I haven't been here in years. I don't know how many years. And I thought about it. I cannot. I don't know. But uh, anyway, I was at this store, and um, it's a nice Walmart uh, neighborhood store, I think they call it, but or market or something like that and uh, it's not that you know the huge one like you can go to a superstore no it's just a neighborhood grocery market or whatever they put on it anyway I got out and I was parked up closer to the front because there was a spot there and all of a sudden it started getting busy I mean and people were driving in real close you know <laughs> and I'm like I started to get that weird feeling like hey wait a minute you're in my space you know, <laughs> but I mean, it was like all of a sudden a whole bunch of got real busy, a whole bunch of cars. Like, I'm like, where in the world they all come from? You know, was there a light? And they were all just coincidentally at the light. And yeah, I mean, it was to park now to go into the store. Wow, that was unusual. It was a weird feeling too, all around. Okay, anyway, but yeah, <laughs> it was a strange feeling. This, all, all of a sudden, I was I was talking to Adam on the phone actually, and uh, you know, told him, you know, I was talking to him about what he wants if he wants me to get him something to eat while I'm out here and all that, because yeah, it's lunchtime, and uh, I just bought a bunch of groceries. And I'm not gonna be cooking anyway. And we were talking, and all of a sudden, these these cars and everybody started driving, and I was like, that that, that was freaky to me. <laughs> You know, somebody in front of me, somebody on this side, somebody behind, on this side of me, that side of me, in front of me, on the other side. You know, two over there, and one guy, he he was a young guy, and uh, he parked, he backed up into, had a sports car, backed up into a uh, uh, disabled spot for people, you know, with disabilities. And uh, usually here, from what I understand, they usually have a tag on the on the uh, rearview mirror, you know, hanging underneath it, and he didn't, and he backed in and got out, and, you know, it doesn't have to be physical, so, uh, but, uh, I'm like, I don't like when people do that, so I don't know if he did or not, but still, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, I did not see he had any sticker, nothing on his license plate, nothing on his windshield, and... Just the, the whole thing gave me the feeling like, uh uh, he's just, he doesn't care. You know, he just doesn't care. Now, I'm not, I don't have to park in one of those myself. You know, I have known people in my life, of course, that needed it, had to, and all that, and then they have to deal with some people like that. I could be wrong, like I said. 